bipartisan calls tonight for public hearings on those giant increases in heating costs that we warned you about. Consumers this winter could see gas utility bills up to 50% higher than they were last winter. As our political editor Mike Flannery reports, state lawmakers want to know why. The top-ranking Republican on the Illinois Senate's Energy Committee proposed public hearings today to put gas utility executives on the hot seat. Or why do the experts feel that the cost of natural gas is going to go through the roof? And it's very difficult um, to be able to pay 30 to 40 to 50 percent increase on your uh, gas bill during the winter. Even before those big increases hit, already hundreds of thousands of local consumers have stopped paying gas utility bills. A spokesman for People's Gas and North Shore Gas noted gas and oil prices are soaring all over the world. Today's headline on a New York Times column, the coming energy winter will be scary. Don't blame the Greens. Illinois is, in fact, requiring the eventual shutdown of all coal and gas-fired power plants but not yet. It's not renewable energy or green energy uh, that's causing this problem. It's a spike in gas demand. NICOR gas in the suburbs, people's gas in Chicago are also under fire for multi-billion dollar pipe replacement work. It's already added $156 a year to consumer bills in Chicago and it's only about a third done. Senator Rezin wants that spending reined in. I know that the Attorney General's office uh, has concerns as well, and I know as a state legislator, I've always had concerns uh, regarding the increase that we've seen. A People's Gas spokesman said the utility does comply with state law and that the pipe replacement work is necessary for safety. Making the upcoming hearings all but certain, State Senate President Don Harmon endorsed the idea tonight. I'm Fox 32 Chicago's political editor, Mike Flannery.